Poland announced on Thursday it would send four MiG-29 fighter jets to Ukraine, making it the first of Kyiv's allies to provide such aircraft. One of Ukraine's staunchest supporters, Warsaw has taken a leading role in persuading sometimes hesitant allies to provide Kyiv with heavy weaponry. The jets are expected to be delivered in four to six weeks. Ostril. Meanwhile, the constant boom of artillery fire filled the air near Bakhmut on Thursday. From inside a hideout, a soldier from Ukraine's 80th Air Assault Brigade gives his assessment of the front lines. The situation is quite difficult, but stable. The enemy constantly attempts to attack us, and we defend our positions quite effectively. We've been standing here for quite long already, and our brigade hasn't given up any positions. Their position is not far from where Ukrainian and Russian troops are facing off outside Bakhmut, a hotly contested city. Since a major Ukrainian counteroffensive last year, the war has settled into a grinding conflict of incremental gains, as Ukraine urges its allies in the West to supply more modern military hardware and ammunition. While Russia appears to be in the ascendancy in key areas like Bakhmut, progress is slow and costly, and Ukraine says it is determined to hold out. So we were informed uh, by by the decision uh, by the Pol uh, by Poland uh, to uh, provide the jets to Ukraine. So we continue to closely coordinate with our allies and partners, including Poland, uh, as we provide assistance to Ukraine. Uh, yesterday, Secretary Austin, as you probably know, the tenth uh, hosted the tenth Ukraine defense contact group, in which countries around the world continue to step up.